project special is finally live on steam if you haven't heard about it yet let me fill you in. Project Spatial is this amazing tool developed by Liv, the same folks who made it possible for us to create these awesome mixed reality videos. So this new app allows us to record spatial videos of our games. What are spatial videos? They are more than our regular 3D or 360 videos. These videos have depth and they give you 6 degrees of freedom. It's more or less like capturing a volumetric video which means that you can get immersed in a video of a gameplay and you no longer have to be confined to a flat screen. Right now, this tool is in the pre-alpha stage and the only game you can record for now is Gorilla Tag along with some mods. In this video, I'll show you the entire setup process to record and watch spatial videos. First, you need to install the Steam version of Gorilla Tag. Then, you'll need to install the Steam version of Project Spatial so that you can record videos and to watch those recorded videos you'll need to install the project special app on your quest device along with that you need to install the steam link app on your device so that you can play the game i did try using quest link but it did not work too well first you need to download the latest version of monkey mod manager and run the program. From this list, you'll have to install the Bepinex mod which would have been selected by default and along with that, you need to select the Utila mod and click on install. Next, download the latest version of Spatial Gorilla mod and extract the files. Now, you'll have to move these files to the location of the game files which you can easily get by going inside Steam, right click on Gorilla tag, Select manage and click on browse local files. Now all that's left to do is to copy the files from the mod and paste it inside the gorilla tag folder. Now this will give you a pop up asking if you want to replace the files, please do that. Now put on your headset and launch steam link. Make sure that your laptop and your headset are connected to the same steam account and they're connected to the same Wi-Fi. And from here you can launch gorilla tag. Next. On your PC, launch the Project Spatial app and put on your headset. Now to record spatial video, you can click on the camera icon and here you'll be able to see the camera and on this pier it will show you what exactly that camera is able to see. You can grab it, you can move it around and set it to the position that you want or you can go inside the camera settings and here there are certain presets like head talking or third person. I think I'd like to keep it at third person and I want it to follow me and I want it to look at me. So wide is fine and the duration is for 60 seconds. And now I can click on the icon button and let's go and record our gameplay. Now after 60 seconds it stops recording automatically and you can watch your video by going inside the gallery and playing it from here. Now this will open up a spear which you can select and bring it close to you and watch your gameplay in spatial which looks really cool. Now to watch this spatial video inside quest independently you can simply click on this icon to publish but before that you will have to log in or sign up and connect it to your meta account. Once you're signed in, you can choose your thumbnail, click on next, add a title to your video, click on next and then publish it. Once it's done publishing, you will get a notification that it's published successfully and then you can quit the application. Now inside your meta headset, open the project spatial app, acknowledge that this app might be buggy and in here you can select discover and here you will be able to see your app which is called spatial video and once you select this it will open up the spatial player which you can grab and rotate resize and look around this looks really amazing you have the feature to change the orb as well so you can change it from a sphere to a rectangle or a cube and they look pretty cool too i would really love to have an option to share these videos with my friends and i'm pretty sure it will come along with the future updates and i cannot wait to see what other games are compatible with this and that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one.